Hey guys, Techno Chill with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your live voicemail if it's not working. So one of the big exciting updates of iOS 17 is being able to leave live voicemail like this one. If you're calling someone on FaceTime and you want to leave a voicemail, you can do it just like that. But sometimes it's not working on your device. So how can you fix it? Well, the first thing is you have to understand that live voicemail currently on iOS 17 on Apple's website says that it's only available in English in United States and Canada. So those are the only countries at the moment that's available. It excludes Guam, Puerto Rico, and the Virgin Islands and anywhere else in the world. So if you're in the US or the Canada, you're only able to use live voicemail. And in the future, it might change, but that's right now the limitation of it. Now, after that, let's say you are in the US or Canada or outside, you can also do kind of change the setting on your phone to get it in order to check first that your live voicemail setting is on, which should be on by default. But if you go into your settings and then find your phone setting here, and then if you go all the way down here where it says live voicemail, it should be on like here already by default if it's not on for you. Now, let's say you're out of that US or the Canada region and you still want to use it, you can do that by going to your settings and then you can go to general here and then you can go to language and region and then you can change the region here and the language here. So first thing is you want to make sure that you have language, English as a preferred language and then you want to change your region here to the US or the Canada one. Now, once you do that, your live voicemail will work for you. But I do want to give you a warning that when you do change the region here, if you're outside of those region, things like Apple Pay and some Apple services don't work correctly. And that's the issue with trying to change it here and then not being in those regions. So be careful when you do change it. So if you do encounter an issue, I recommend keeping your region the same although the feature might not be available for your region. So that's how live voicemail currently is working. I'll give you guys another update once I hear that, you know, things have changed, but currently United States and Canada is the only one that can use live voicemail. And I hope that Apple expands that feature to other regions as well. So thanks for watching guys. And I hope you guys found this video helpful and for future updates and tips and tricks on your iPhone, hit that like and subscribe button. See you guys next time.